combat COVID-19 across the United States. One company that's based in Overland Park is sending health care workers to other parts of the country. KSHB 41 News reporter Emma James spoke with one of their nurses who currently is in Texas. She shares what it's like to fight the Delta variant firsthand. You know, taking care of people is ministry. You know, this being a nurse is not what I do, it's who I am. From the HIV epidemic to Ebola and now COVID-19, Glenda Hawkins has seen it all. She's currently working at a hospital in Tyler, Texas, where she says 85% of COVID patients have the Delta variant. This, this strain is weird, it's different. Uh, so the most important thing as a, a clinician, I would say is get your vaccinations. Hawkins is one of thousands of nurses deployed to areas around the country by Overland Park based crucial staffing. CEO Brian Cleary says the company did its largest ever deployment of healthcare workers at the height of the pandemic. After a lull earlier this spring, the demand for travel nurses is increasing fast. If uh, 2020 was house on fire, this may be just kind of the garage on fire. Uh, so not uh, nothing of that level yet, and I hope we don't get there. Cleary says he anticipates the demand will continue to rise with the increase in Delta variant cases. Hawkins says it's disheartening to see variant cases ramp up while some continue to choose not to get vaccinated. Being there watching people die, you know, we've had a lot of notebook moments where a husband and wife died together. We put them in the same room. I've experienced a family of five dying. With hospitals seeing more and more breakthrough cases, she says vaccinated people shouldn't let their guard down. Continue operating as if this was the very beginning of the pandemic. Continue using social distancing, continue masking. In Overland Park, Emma James, KSHB 41 News.